And we have a beautiful fall day today, about 61 degrees outside. And I kind of wanted to stick around the local area here and do a little flying. So um, I thought I'd uh, come down to Carson Park and uh, see if I could see any leaves changing. So we'll kind of fly around the park at about 380 feet today. And we have just a light breeze. And it looks like we got a few trees turning down there. There's some yellows and oranges. Water looks pretty calm by the reflection of the buildings. And right kind of on the top there, that's Half Moon Beach. It's kind of going over to the right side now. Of course, not too many people are swimming in October. In this uh, bare area in the left side, they had a pretty big storm come through and knocked down a lot of trees. Uh, it's starting to grow back pretty good now. But kind of right in this area, uh, maybe in close to the center of the screen, uh, they lost quite a few trees in the park. And there's all kinds of playgrounds for the kids and nice areas to walk in. Today would have been a beautiful day to go for a walk. Uh, this is a place Eau Claire holds their fireworks every year. And we got one yellow tree down there that's really giving it all it's got there. And what we're seeing coming up here is called Bronze Bay, an area where people come and fish. There's a uh, kind of a dock out there you can fish off of. And that is kind of right there towards the bottom there. You can see the dock. Half Moon isn't a real deep lake. 
and there's no uh, powered motorized uh, boats allowed. You can take a canoe or some boat that's uh, powered by human strength. And if we look at that building right there, I believe that's going to be the new YMCA building. And that looks like a steel frame down the middle and then stick built. Now right here, I didn't realize that this area here was kind of marshy like this. So that's kind of interesting. And right straight ahead there uh, towards the top center right now, that's going to be the new bridge going across. They're going to have a lot of fishing spots to fish there and I think they're going to have a kayak launching area. They're going to widen it out quite a bit from what it was so that should be uh, a real asset to the community right there. Uh, the nice thing about Half Moon is you can uh, have your line in the water in 15 minutes and and uh, so if you just have a small amount of time to do some fishing, uh, you just drive down, throw your line in, and, and uh, get busy catching fish. And panfish are probably the most prevalent. Sunfish, uh, there are bass in there. There are some walleye in there. And maybe a northern or two. After Christmas, you can come down here and drop your Christmas tree off, and they'll make sure that it gets recycled. I thought I'd give a little extra time to that yellow tree there. It's trying so hard to show its yellow colors. So And now we'll come down. So I thought I'd just stop and take a look and see um, how things were coming down here, how the leaves were doing. So there you have it, a little stroll around Carson Park.